Hey now, say now, what's happening, man? Yeah, man. Back with another episode of this thing, man. We call Kicking Grits, baby. It's your player partner, Rick, man. If this your first time watching one of my videos, man, I want you to go ahead and tap that subscribe for me one time. And go ahead and uh, tap on that like while you're at it. Dislike if you dislike, you feel me? It's all good. It's all love either way. You understand me? Um, this some this some uh, this some good news you can use right here, man. Uh, I got some clips, two clips for you guys. I, I, I'm liking these clips, man. Let me know, man. Somebody tell me if I'm doing something wrong, man. Tell me if they if I'm posting the wrong wrong clips or something. Or you don't like them or something, man. You know what I mean? I, I, I like comments, baby. You feel me? So uh, go ahead and give me some comments or something. I need commentary. You feel me? But uh, yeah, man. We gonna get off into this clip in a second, man. We speaking to the souls and to the hearts and the minds of young ladies and young men out there, man. You know what I mean? Or anybody that's receptive to the information that may need it. You know what I mean? Like I said, it's news you can use, baby. Yeah. No, I'm not perfect, no. I made my mistakes, and no. But all I want is love and conditional. Here creating super niggas in their mind. They don't even be looking at the niggas right in front of them. That's the difference between men and women. We see who here. Right. Women down here think it's a unicorn nigga with his own dick and a lot of money and a weekend house and this nigga write poetry and draw and he's a thug and he can fight and lift weights and don't eat pork. You crazy? <laughs> you gonna meet this nigga with a lace front on? <laughs> Okay, alright, alright, I'm tripping though. What, 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 what he said, man? Man, that nigga, they want that nigga have everything. <laughs> hey, man, hey, man, say, man, we back. Yeah, we just doing a little bit more comfortable, you know what I'm saying? But, uh, hey, yeah, yeah, that's crazy what Buddy was saying, right? <laughs> a lot of women be like that, you feel me? With these high ass expectations and shit, man. You know what I mean? Like he said, man. You know what I mean? A lot of women really be looking for like a fantasy super nigga type shit. And you get one wrong. If you don't check all them boxes, man. If you don't check every single box that these women be coming with these high expectations, a lot of them they be, they don't even have nothing going on. You know what I'm saying? They be ghetto. Don't even look the best. You feel me? And they got the most confidence in the world. You feel me? It don't make no sense to me. You know, and expect you to be this and that and that and this and that and have this. You got to be rich and balling and look good, smell good, know how to talk, entertain them. You feel what I'm saying? That shit crazy to me. Entertain them? So I'm sad with the entertainer too now, huh? Am I getting paid for this bitch? Hey, look, man. That shit crazy to me, man. You know, how they be, uh, how they be like that. And it's fucked up because... It, it, it puts a lot of women in a bad space too because then they can't find nothing good. They can't find nothing what they think is good. They pass up the good nigga. You know what I'm saying? The nigga that he might not check every single box, but he a 90% nigga. He good to fit her. You feel what I'm saying? That fits her. You feel what I mean? Um, and her motherfucking uh, level of nigga that she need to have, that should have. You know what I mean? And uh, they really look past that man. You know what I'm saying? A nigga, you know, a lot of times, the good guy, he, he don't put too much effort in because he ain't really got no game and he ain't no chaser and he ain't no, you know what I'm saying? That's the good nigga that ain't really moving out. He ain't outside wild and, you know what I mean, having it like that. You know what I mean? So, it, 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 they, they pass up on them niggas, you know? And then they look for the one they think is that nigga that got everything going on or that guy that got all this shit going on. He lit, he live, you know what I'm saying? Fly, fly shit. But then they got drama, and they got problems. You feel me? And then you end up in another in a, in a fucked up situation. Where the next clip explains that. I like these clips. Yeah, 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 yeah. I like these clips. I've seen so many more women cheat, and being a woman myself, I get to be an insider to the things that women talk about. And yes, they will admit to one another that they cheat but you will never hear an ounce of remorse. They always victimize themselves. What they'll say is, instead of saying, you know what, I cheated, it was wrong. Um, it was dishonest of me, it was betrayal, and I'll never do it again. What you will hear is, 
Well, I cheated because I had to. He wasn't giving me what I needed and what I deserved as a woman. And all the other women will, you know, jump right in and, you know, be victims and victimize her saying, oh, you poor thing. Um, he should have treated you better. You take care of his kids and you do this and you do that. And he should have appreciated you more and you wouldn't have had to go screw another man. But it's, it's really uh, quite scary how they do that. But they... They're never remorseful, and they always shift the blame. Man, 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 ain't that the motherfucking truth, man? They do it, man. You know they do it. They do it a lot, man. These women victimize themselves, man, because they put themselves in a situation where they really shouldn't have been in in the first place, man. You know, uh, and instead of looking for a, a, a better lick, man. You know what I'm saying? I say a lick, man. You know that's the motherfucker that they with. You know they look at a lot of a lot of these females nowadays. They look at men like the lick. You know the man supposed to take care of them, take them, take them here, do them, do this for them, and pay for this for them, and. Buy them this, buy me this, buy me that syndrome shit. You feel me? And they and they get fucked off in that and end up with a motherfucker that they really don't like because they'll take a motherfucker that just got a little bit, they got some bread and shit, you know? He might have been cute or whatever and they thought he was this and that, you know? He checked all the boxes in the beginning of the situation but then ended up not checking all the boxes, you know? Because then later on what they did is they found more boxes to get checked. And that's outside of the man spec. But they was happy with the motherfucker in the beginning. You understand me? It's crazy how that shit happened, you know? Cause they steady watching social media, listening to other bitches with bad information, watching these TV shows and shit, man. Listening to this fucked up music, city girls and shit, man. Thinking that they that and they ain't, you know what I mean? Shit crazy, bro. Like, it's just, it's just a lot of fucked up shit going on out here, man. You know, I want everybody out there, man. Y'all be safe, man. Y'all, you know what I mean? Fuck with those who fuck with you, man. You know? Love ho love those. <laughs> I'm tipsy, man. Don't fuck, fuck with me, man. It's, hey, man. Hey. Love those who love you, man. Yeah. I got another video I'm talking uh, I want to do, man, talking about that type of shit, man. You know, how people you show love to and... It's crazy how you will show love to people time and time again, and for some reason that shit gets mixed, misunderstood. You know, it's like it's it's almost like they can't accept love from you. You feel what I'm saying? Because they really want to hate you. So you show them love, they they take it as something negative. They looking at it as it's negative, off the rip. They can't accept the love that you're giving them as just genuine love, and that's what it is. It ain't no subliminal, you know what I'm saying? Ain't nothing, ain't nothing to it. It is what it is. Some people just can't accept the truth that you're a really good person, you know, and that you genuinely want to help a motherfucker. Some people look for the flaws in people. They can't accept all the good things that they do. They look for that shit. Hey man, it's just like what we say. Hey, give me a reason, man. Give me a reason, man. Yeah, give me a reason. You know what I mean? That that type of attitude. I wish a motherfucker would, man. Why you wanna wish a motherfucker would? You know what I'm saying? I hope a motherfucker don't. <laughs> you feel me? Hey man, I'd like to keep it peaceful, man. You know what I mean? I'm gonna protect myself, you know what I mean? At all costs. I'm gonna tell you, I'm gonna get a secret, man. Look, I, 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 I'm a care. Hey man, I got my motherfucking license. Carry all that type shit like that, man. And uh, we, t I talk about mental health and shit like that because I've been there, right? You know, I done seen the psychiatrist. I've been diagnosed. You feel me? I'm documented on paper. You feel me? That I got some issues mentally. So don't fuck with me. Cause if I do something to you, man, I, I'm, I'm in the most legitimate place ever. You feel what I'm saying? I'm gonna walk away from this shit Scott motherfucking free because I'm telling motherfuckers off the rip, don't fuck with me, leave me alone, I got problems, man. I don't, I don't, hey, I don't look for bullshit. A lot of people look for that shit, man. Yeah, but that's a whole nother motherfucking, you feel me? I'm, hey, like I said, man, I keep it peaceful, peaceful, peaceful. I stay out the motherfucking way and out they motherfucking face. But yeah, man, a lot of you ladies, though, you're moving wrong. 
You know what I'm saying? You moving wrong. You moving wrong. You really need to figure out what it is that you want out of life first. Figure out what it is that you want out of life. What do you want out of life? What are your goals? What are your passions? What are your dreams? You know what I'm saying? Um, where do you see yourself 20 years, 10 years, 15 years, five years, next year? You know what I'm saying? Like, what do you see yourself? What do you see yourself doing? How do you see yourself living? You feel what I'm saying? And then, in the midst of that, the type of person that that you need in your life will be presented to you. You need to check your own motherfucking list, your own boxes first. You know what I'm saying? And figure out who the fuck you is, what the fuck you want. And it ain't got to do with nothing about no man. It got to do about you, first and foremost. You feel what I'm saying? And once you do that, then the type of man that you need, the type of man that you need, not the man that you want. You can't always get everything that you want in life, baby. I'm going to cut it to you like that, man. You know what I mean? Like a butter knife on hot, a motherfucker, a hot butter knife on butter, man. You know what I'm talking about, man? You know, real smooth like, though. I'm going to cut it to you like that, though. And you're going to be able to weather through all the storm, man. You're going to weather through it, you feel me? And get to it, you feel me? But, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. That type of man will be presented to you in, uh, in those thoughts. And, you know, like they say, you know, what you think about, you bring about. You know, um. You know, you're gonna bring about something that's gonna match you, that's gonna fit you, your personality, your type, and all of those, check all the, the right boxes in your life, you know? But I'm ranting, I'm, I, you know, this good nigga sipping on this shit, man. I'm chilling, man, you know what I mean? I, I ain't on too much, man, you know what I'm talking about, man? Yeah, man, till the next time, though, man, like I always say, man, make sure you go ahead, like, share, subscribe. Somebody might need to hear this video, man. We gonna start doing lives real soon. Um, yeah, we're going to do them Friday night lives, man. We're going to do lives real soon. I'm thinking uh, we're going to start doing I'm start doing the lives on Instagram. And uh going to tap in with other people on the lives. So the Kick and Grits channel on Instagram, I'm going to start doing lives and uh, answer some people's questions. And we're going to do some talks and... And uh, yeah, get it in just like that. Fuck it up, sis. 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 I love it. 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 Yes, baby. Yes. Yes. How does it feel knowing no one yes. wants to fuck you? That is beautiful. Yes, yes sir. Yes, sir. Is this my black? Ah. Yes, sir. Yes, yes, sir. Yes, yes, sir. Yes, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Y'all love it. How does it feel I'm a G child, this is God's plan. And we gon' keep it lit in the meanwhile. I said we gon' keep it lit in the meanwhile. Uh, no guts, no glory. No pain, no gain, no worries. And we gon' make a happy in the story. I said we gon' make a happy in the story. So delete all insecurities. Open your mind and invest in me. Like the bank reaching levels that they can't As long as you understand I ain't No, I'm not perfect, no I made my mistakes and no But all I want is love and conditional Love and conditional I don't deserve it, no But it would be worth it all All I want is love and conditional Love and conditional Can you know that I know
know that you ain't, and I ain't in no way perfect. No way, no way, no way. Give a nigga no way, this no way. Just give a nigga no condition, no love. Uh. And you know that I know that you ain't, and I ain't in no way perfect. No way, no way, no way. Give a nigga no way, this no way. Just give a nigga no So we gon' live, fuck what they say. Turn up. Bond is spiritual, more than physical. That's why I'm into you, I said that's why I'm into you You listen to what I say, you knowin' just what I like You're loving me when I'm wrong, you're loving me when I'm right The feeling's mutual, gotta let you know That a nigga need love unconditional And teamwork to make the dream work And loyalty to bring the royalty, let's ball in the king's court No, I'm not perfect.